Well, the death penalty is another divisive topic throughout our country. Some states have it, others don't. Idaho, though, it does. And the death penalty was officially established in Idaho in 1864. Right now, there are eight people on Idaho's death row. But the last time someone was actually executed in Idaho was the year 2012. Gerald Pizzuto is one of the eight, and he is the longest serving death row inmate in Idaho. He's been on death row for three decades after being convicted of first degree double murder. In December of last year, Pizzuto was scheduled for execution by lethal injection, but it was called off because the Idaho Department of Correction couldn't get their hands on the necessary chemicals. But today, Idaho Attorney General Raul Labrador said a new death warrant for Pizzuto, saying, quote, the state will continue to attempt to obtain the necessary drugs for lethal injection. Pizzuto's new execution date is now set for March 23rd, and this comes days after legislation was introduced in Idaho to reinstate the firing squad as a secondary method for the death penalty. Interesting timing because even if the legislation does become law, it wouldn't be legal before Pizzuto's death warrant expires. But the attorney general can just ask for another one if they don't get the chemicals in time. Today, we heard from Governor Brad Little on this legislation and the death penalty. I'm a proponent uh, for capital punishment, but we need to do it in the most dignified and humane manner that creates the least amount of stress with my corrections uh, team. 